Hey guys, whatever is up. So today we are going to talk about fans suspecting Luca's return, kneeling on the fire for alleged rude behavior, Crash responding back to Ryujin, and Luna's true revealing shocking health issues. So without wasting your time, let's dive in. It's been over a year since Luca's scandal, and now it seems like SM Entertainment is slowly trying to bring him back. That's what the fans think. Yesterday, SM Entertainment uploaded a new video on their SMP Floor channel of Super M Camera War Guide for Dropping. Many fans were happy to see Lucas in it and started speculating that even though this video was probably filmed back in 2020, there is still a chance for him to come back. Lucas has been also slowly coming back to social media and many fans are hoping that he will take a part in Wavy's comeback. So let me guys know if you think if he's coming back or not. Moving on, Espa is now in France for the Paris Fashion Week. Fans have posted a video of Ning Ning walking to her car with fans screaming her name but Ning Ning continued to quietly walk towards her car. In one Twitter post that includes the video clip, one netizen raised a question if Ning Ning covered her ear after hearing fans calling out her name. Other Twitter users came at the OP for taking a short clip out of context, as Ning Ning was just adjusting her airpod. Fans are defending Ning Ning as she's been recently stalked by fans in Paris and had troubles with her visa. They are also pointing out that none of French fans have said anything bad about Ning Ning. Moving on, let's talk about Itzy's Ryujin and Soloist crush. Recently Ryujin and Yeji went on live where Yeji read out a comment that said Crash should pay more taxes. She didn't really understand the comment and that's when Ryuji said that he's dating Joy. Yeji still didn't understand why it's related to the comment, to which Ryuji replied with people are telling him to pay more taxes. This caused netizens to criticize Ryuji with comments such as their action was toeless, but they'll probably be better about it next time. They're both female idols, so it was kind of toeless of them to to say that. Now, Korean netizens are wondering if Crush's Instagram story is a reply to Ryujin or not. Crush wrote, happiness is attitude. No matter how you look, friendliness makes you into the most beautiful person in the world. Netizens went on online forum to comment his Instagram story, commenting, she has nothing to say, even if Crush targets her, Crush and Joy must have been so annoyed. If I were a celebrity, I would hate it if someone talk about my relationship and a company junior at that too? LOL. Crush also uploaded something like this when he received hate after he was discharged from the military. So I think he is addressing this issue regarding Eugene. But let me guys know what do you think. Recently, Luna's true shocked her fans after she confessed that she's struggling with eating disorder. True appeared on Dr. O's Golden Clinic. In the trailer, she's showing her signature smile, but soon she's revealing she's been struggling with eating disorder, stating she has been even admitted to the hospital due to it. She confessed she eats until she cannot breathe and throws up because of stress. Dr. O told her she might be doing this to hurt herself, to which True explained some of her fears and what she's been stressing about lately. She feels like she can't let anyone know she's hurting. Dr. O suggested that all her fears will be lost if she lets down her mask. Many fans have been showing support to True in the comments saying, don't cry, we love you for you, no matter what. I hope you are always happy. It is okay to let us know when you are struggling and cry if you feel like crying, so let's just be happy. Whatever you're happy, or said, you are you. I hope you know that we love you for exactly who you are. So let me guys know what do you think down in the comments. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more. That is it for today. Bye!